Hey, this is Carlo with 4GQ TV here at Holiday Matsuri, and I'm here with. Uh, my name is Edwin. I'm the marketing director here at Gamers Outreach. And can you tell us a little bit about Gamers Outreach? Yeah, Gamers Outreach is a nonprofit organization, and our main mission is to bring accessibility to video games to children's hospitals. That sounds awesome. Uh, when did you get started? So the charity started in uh, 2007 when our founder, Zach Weigel, started a Halo LAN tournament. And uh, that LAN tournament is actually still ongoing today, but it's called Gamers for Giving, which, by the way, it is coming back uh, April 57th in the Eastern Michigan uh, University. It's going to be in the Game Above Center. That's where their uh, basketball team plays. And you told me with Holiday Matsuri, you guys have some type of partnership agreement, and there's a charity ball, and if you raise so much, what, what might be built? Yeah, so uh, so we're here at Holiday Matsuri, first of all. Uh, this is our first year here, and so far it's been a great uh, turnout. It's The, the vibes are, are, are incredible here. The cosplays are super top-notch. But, yeah, our partnerships include, uh, yeah, uh, being partner of the charity ball here at Holiday Matsuri. And um, whatever they raise by people buying a ticket to the uh, charity ball here, uh, will go towards uh, go karts. So if they every thirty five hundred dollars that they raise here at Holly Matsuri will go towards a go kart to a hospital of their choice. That's awesome. Yep. And Gamers Outreach partners with different streamers. They partner with different organizations, um, different events, and a lot of people in the gaming community already know about you guys. And the board, you have a board of advisors, yep. which is very impressive. Um, are you able to say any of the names of people on the board of advisors? Yeah, we have uh, some very high-level, incredible talent in the gaming industry. We have like people like Jordan Reese, uh, Aaron Greenberg from Microsoft. Jordan Reese started uh, Astro Gaming back in many, many years ago. Uh, so, you know, we have some great talent that really helps push gamers outreach that are not only uh, love gaming, but also love the cause of bringing games to be accessible to children's hospitals. And what brought you over to Gamers Outreach? So I have worked with Gamers Outreach while my time was at Astro Gaming. Uh, and when they were looking for a marketing director, um, it, it's a no brainer, right? Uh, going from a stance of product marketing into a stance of doing something that really feels good every single day, you know what you're getting out of it, right? So when you're going to someone and you're pitching uh, a partnership where you're pitching a deck is it's not the same it's like hey uh we want to put this headset here we want to put this here but in all in all when it comes to a nonprofit and helping you know helping kids in such an incredible cause i just i go in into that pitch with a smile you know it's like hey we're helping kids we're doing great we're helping kids feel that normalcy that they should have at hospitals instead of just sitting there and, you know, maybe staring at the TV for, you know, for however long they're there, because a lot of hospitals don't have that form of entertainment. And we are making that form of entertainment accessible at, you know, children's hospitals. Uh, that's, that's amazing. Any big events coming up for Gamers Outreach? So, as I mentioned, Gamers for Giving, it's our big annual LAN event taking place in Eastern Michigan State University. Um, and that's coming up on April 57th. We do have some presence at other events such as PAXs, uh, Dream Hacks as well. So uh, sometimes we have a booth, sometimes we don't. But you you can definitely catch our team, our development team going there, um, and you know we're trying to talk to new partners and talking to streamers. So hopefully continuing raising money throughout the year and kind of building up the cause. Yeah, absolutely, it's an amazing cause. And for anybody watching this, how can they get involved? How can they donate? So for anybody watching, if you go to gamersoutreach.org, we have, you can look at all of our programs there. You can look at all of our financials so you can make sure that our nonprofit is legit. First of all, um, you can donate directly to the website. We have many pillar events throughout the year that you will be able to participate if you are a content creator, um, such as, again, Gamers for Giving. There is an online element to Gamers for Giving that you can raise money from home. We have the VTuber Summer Slam, which is one of our most popular events. The entire VTuber community comes together to raise money for the cause. And then that goes towards more gold cards for children's hospitals. And then we have another big event is in uh, October. The entire month of October, we call it Spectacular. 
People dress up, they stream, they have a great time. Another big event. And if you guys want to, you know, be a part of it, you guys can reach us at uh, contact at gamersoutreach.org. Send us an email. Tell us you want to be a part of it. And it's just as simple as that. Now, I know some people might have some questions. Uh, A lot of streamers ask, well, do we have to have a certain amount of numbers or audience to get involved? Such a great, yeah, such a great question. No, we accept anybody that is just willing to just be a part of it and understand the cause. I, I would rather people come in understanding the cause and just be like, hey, I want to do something good. Understand the cause and it doesn't matter what numbers you have. We're happy to have you because any little any little bit makes a difference. So, yeah. Oh, yeah, certainly. I've seen these go-karts and they are amazing. They're spectacular. The kids love them at the hospitals. If you see the pictures of the kids enjoying it and sometimes people come in from the game industry, play with the kids, developers. <laughs> um, even behind you, we have a cosplayer dressed as a stormtrooper um, playing at a hospital. Yep. So there's a, a lot of hospitals when we uh, will we'll tend to do special events as well. Um, and what happens is that, you know, uh, when a company or an individual donates a certain amount of go-karts, uh, we talk to the hospitals to do, hey, what can we do to make a, a, an event possible for these kids? And, you know, like Halloween, that's where the Stormtrooper came in. Other hospitals would do uh, Minecraft boxes and kids can create their own Minecraft like helmets oh, and, awesome. and then play Minecraft on the go-karts. So there are so much incredible things that we do partner up with the hospitals to kind of make that, uh, you know, level up the, you know, the, the level of play and activity at the hospitals for these kids. So that's amazing, man. Yep. Well, thank you so much for your time. I hope to get to run into you again at another convention. <laughs> yeah, um, um, It'll be great. It, it's been a great time just talking to you and learning about more about gamers outreach. And I hope our audience gets involved. Yep. Uh, again, thank you so much, Carlo. I really appreciate it. And again, if you guys want to get involved, just contact at gamersoutreach.org or just visit our website, gamersoutreach.org, to learn more. Thank you, guys. Thank you.